The dangers of cyberbullying and sexting were part of a discussion this evening involving boys and girl scouts of Troop 25 in Canfield. New at 10, here's First News reporter Jacob Thompson. About 25 scouts sat in and listened to some of the dangers that technology brings, from sexting to cyberbullying and many other things. As a way to set it up, a simple question was asked. So who this evening is willing to give me their social security number? Anyone? Granted, the question was sarcastic. It was meant to establish that some people share secretive information with others, such as sexually explicit photos. Because of all of the different things that they can do with that information, with those photos, with those videos, whatever it might be. The kids learned about different times when people were bullied for any reason. Stories about young people that took their own lives from being bullied. They learned the letter of the law behind people who bully others or have sexual photos of people under the age of 18. Doing these type of behaviors, you could be charged with a sex offense. And being charged, what we said before, for consequences, because we all get, have consequences for our behaviors, you could end up in de the detention center. While the conversation was not meant to scare the kids, it was to warn them about things they could be facing at their age, even if the topics were heavy. Just before you say anything, just take into account what you think that person's situation could be, because they could be going through something you have no idea about. Think about what you do before you're going to do it. Think about how it's going to affect both you currently, you in the future, whether that be the next day at school or 20 years down when you're trying to get a job. The program was put on by the Mahoning County Prosecutor's Office and the Juvenile Court. In Canfield, Jacob Thompson, WKBN 27 First News.